Welcome to today's video. In this video, I'm going to continue looking at square roots and cube roots. And in today's video, I'm going to look at cube roots. Uh, in this video, I'm going to describe what cube roots are. I'm going to also show how you write the cube root of a number. Then later on, I'm going to demonstrate how you can find uh, cube roots of given numbers. So watch this video up to the end. Let me start by defining what a cube root is. So <clears throat> a cube root of a number is a number you multiply by itself and then multiply the result by the original number to get the, to get that number. Okay, so a cube root is the number you multiply by itself and then multiply the results by the original number to get that number. So, in other words, we are saying a cube root is a cube root of a number is the number you multiply by itself three times to get that number. Okay, so in this scenario, I'm talking about when you have got a number, then you, you multiply a certain number to get that number, then the number you have multiplied three times is a cube root. What I'm trying to say is this. Uh, for instance, I'm multiplying 3 by 3 by 3 in this instance to get 27. I'm multiplying 3 three times to get 27. Therefore, we can say 3 is the cube root of 27. So I've multiplied 3 by 3, which has given me 9, which is the result. Then the result I multiply it by the, the, the result which is nine I multiply it by three the original number which gives me that number which is twenty seven. Okay, so that is a cube root. So a cube root is a number you multiply three times uh, by itself in order to get a cube. Okay, then therefore we can write three as a cube root of 27 like this so this is how you write a cube root of a number so in this uh, example i'm using three i'm using 27 and three so the cube root of three is um 27 uh you will write a small three there then a square root then 27 that is uh, three the cube root of 27 which is three that's how we write the cube root, like the way I've written in red there. Okay. Now let me show you how you how you find cube roots of 